Now, when it comes to plastics, what do we normally think about? We think of plastic bottles, plastic cups, plastic bags, and in some cases, plastic boxes or Tupperware. But in this case, the one that I am talking about is plastic bags. There's only one problem, though. They are really, really bad for the environment. It's agreeable that plastic bags are useful, but they do have a bad history of environmental pollution, and it's understandable why. Plastic bags are actually very difficult to make and they use a lot of certain chemicals and a lot of uh, work and factory workers to be able to produce them. So it kind of goes like this. Traditional plastic bags are usually made from polyethylene which consists of long chains of ethylene monomers. Ethylene is derived from natural gas and petroleum. The polyethylene used in most plastic shopping bags is either low density resident identification code 4 or more often high density, which is resident identification code 2. Color concentrates and other activities are often used to add tint to the plastic. Plastic shopping bags are also commonly manufactured by uh, blown film extrusion. Now all this manufacturing is going on and it just seems really weird how they're doing all this work for just one simple plastic bag. It's understandable though how they're producing many different types of bags and there's many different types of plastic bags that you can find in stores or most convenience stores but it's just a matter of the fact that they take such a long time to make and that they're meant to be used for in a very long time and after all that what do they get used for they end up getting used for a very short time and a short time only you could use them to pick up trash uh, go after your dog's business or just do anything you don't want to use to touch your normal hands with so, all in all, it's a lot of work for just one moment, and then it's thrown away. It never goes away. Never. And it could be found anywhere. I mean, look at this. This is just disgusting, and it's depressing. I mean, do you really want to see something like this? And look at this. This is just, this just spells it out all. Luckily, there's brand new fascinating machines today that can help pick up trash, such as the one you saw in the previous picture. This brings over to my next point. Yes, plastic bags can be useful in many different circumstances, but other than that, it's really not necessary. If you want to avoid plastic bags drifting from your trash, switch over to paper bags. They are more useful, more eco-friendly, or better yet, use a, a canvas bag, which you can be reused anytime, all the time. You can take them up to the grocery store, ask the cashier if you could be able to put all the stuff in that bag and don't have to bother wasting with uh, paper or plastics. We live in such a beautiful world and we don't want to see plastic bags covering any sort of landscapings that you would see in a picture like this. Just please do your best to take care of the earth. I know everything I said may seem opinionated, but I'm just giving out my word for what's best for the environment.